America's oldest city, St. Augustine, Florida, settled by the Spanish in 1565. St. Augustine is often called the city of the centuries because it was already 200 years old when the United States was founded. Castillo de San Marcos National Monument, a massive masonry fortress and a silent witness to history. Impregnable in its day, this huge fortification with walls 30 feet high and 16 feet thick at their base was never captured, a strong sentry by the sea. Ponce de Leon, explorer, visionary, searcher for the Fountain of Youth, named this region Florida. Modern space explorers rocket into the heavens from this world-famous Florida launching complex, the Kennedy Space Center. Man stepping off spot to the moon is a must-see on every tourist list. Exotic plants and flowers form a tropical wonderland in Florida's renowned Cypress Gardens. Over 9,000 varieties of brilliant blooms dazzle the eye of the visitor while he glides through this photographer's paradise in electric boats. Speed, skill, and daring are all part of the daily ski shows at Cypress Gardens. Of course, there's always one guy in every crowd who's just got to make the tourists sit up and take notice. Someone told him to go fly a kite, and suddenly, a whole new career was born. It's a dangerous stunt, and a sudden wind shift could dunk him in the drink. But our hero's not worried. Hi, Mom! Watch my smoke! This is how it looks from up there. Now, do you want to try it? But all's well that ends well, and our high-in-the-sky kite flight ends with not exactly a three-point landing, but a two-ski put-down. You don't have to go all the way to Africa for a jungle cruise. Florida's monkey jungle gives you a close look at North America's first wild monkeys. The setting looks much like a South American rainforest on the shores of the Amazon. But you're only a few miles southwest of the city of Miami. You've seen a horse fly, heard a rubber band, but how about pigs that swim? The waterborne porkers seem right at home, and they add a comic touch to the jungle atmosphere. Everglades National Park, established in 1947 to protect this sprawling subtropical wilderness for future generations. Everglades is a rare habitat for plants and animals seen nowhere else in the United States. A natural biological wonder and a living drama of nature and unspoiled surroundings. West of Ocala, Rainbow Springs features a double-deck sternwheel riverboat cruise down a scenic waterway. Tourists get a more intimate underwater glimpse of marine life in specially built boats with picture windows beneath the waterline. For more adventurous Isaac Waldens, deep sea fishing party boats take crowds of happy anglers to wherever the big ones are biting. Once hooked, it's wise to boat your catch fast before the barracuda comes around to have a free lunch. Despite light tackle, a lucky fisherman can hook a genuine trophy catch. It's a sailfish, and won't the neighbors back home be envious when it's mounted over the mantle? Even the skipper is impressed. He improvises a pennant. Few Florida fun spots rival the excitement of a visit to the famous Sequarium on Virginia Key. It's a playground for porpoises who never tire of doing tricks. TV and movie star Flipper lives here, and his daily routine includes a rubber raft lunch with a pretty mermaid. Try this little number in your backyard pool. Acrobatic porpoises just love a friendly game of leapfrog. Killer whales give the crowd its biggest thrill. Each leap requires enough power to hurl over two tons of massive flesh out of the water. The name killer whale is a contradiction because he's actually gentle and affectionate. Fancy transportation for the sure-footed. What time does the next whale leave? A modern Jonah risks his neck.
A game preserve in deepest Africa, perhaps? Nope. You're just on safari in Florida at Lion Country Safari in West Palm Beach. Born free, these animals roam free in natural settings which rival African jungles and plains. But the law of the jungle is suspended, and hunter and hunted live side by side in peace. Visitors drive through the game park for a unique close-up of wild animal life. Florida is world famous for her citrus crop. Early Spanish settlers first introduced the Valencia orange, and today Florida produces a year-round crop of every possible variety of orange and grapefruit. Florida is no stranger to festivals, and Miami's Orange Bowl Parade is her colorful farewell to the old year and greeting to the new year. Elaborate floats are covered with flowers, and hundreds of thousands of spectators thrill to the annual procession. It's the overture to the main attractions, the Orange Bowl football game, where the top collegiate teams clash. Mobile home communities are common in Florida and provide economical housing in a year-round summertime climate. You can even go to the dogs in Florida, in a nice way, of course. The state features some of the finest greyhound racing tracks in the world. Even the rabbit goes faster here. Of course, lovers of thoroughbred horse racing have not been forgotten. Hialeah ranks among the world's most beautiful gathering spots for improvers of the breed. It's even possible to make a friendly wager or two. Some of the most valuable real estate in the world, the fabulous Gold Coast of Miami Beach. The Atlantic warm by the Gulf Stream provides a perfect playground for both the winter weary and the sun worshiper. If you prefer the pool to the ocean, you've got dozens to choose from, all sizes, all shapes. Uh, I'm talking about the pools, of course. Dress is strictly informal, and a poolside orchestra sets the tempo for this bathing suit ballroom. Beautifully landscaped homes dot the network of inland waterways, while evidence of the good life is everywhere. Florida, a fun state where recreation and retirement are compatible, and the custodian of both natural wonders and man-made luxuries.